Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are from in the whole wide world. This is your man Pixie with another Phoebe Palm video. Now in this video I'm going to be talking about what I think of the Phoebe Palm after using it for um, nearly a month now. Now it's a decent bit of kit for the price. Uh, I think I paid £186 for mine. You can now get it for about £162, £164 upwards. So for the money yeah it's a decent bit of kit. I mean here it is. I've even got a little charger base on, on underneath it as well. So yeah. I like it, um, in my opinion not as good as the Osmo Pocket but still a quality camera. Well when I say not as good, uh, I'm saying the camera quality is not as good in my opinion as the Osmo Pocket but the gimbal in itself is just as good as the Osmo Pocket. Well the Osmo Pocket hasn't got, like I said in my previous videos, the uh, free Wi-Fi and also the free Wi-Fi? Of course it's going to be free. <laughs> <laughs> the Wi-Fi and also the little wheel that you get on it or the uh, joystick so yeah for me I quite like it I quite enjoy it it's nice and light you can hold it for ages and ages and ages and your arms won't get tired unlike mine now holding this big kind of 550d up in the air so I've got to swap hands so yeah I do like I do like it yes um, you know accessories that you can get um, Granted, not as good as DJI's, for argument's sake, the selfie stick, I'll put that up here somewhere. The selfie stick is not as good, it's just all manual, just normal selfie stick. Or the expansions, extension, expansion pole, <laughs> I forget which one to say. But yeah, it's not as good, it's like I said, all manual, no buttons on it. Uh, so if they do introduce um, an extension pole, selfie stick that's got buttons on it and everything all electrical then I would consider getting one of those because you can get some really good footage and then um, you can actually uh, use the buttons on the um, selfie stick itself and not your phone um, so because I haven't quite got used to uh, getting used to using it on the phone um, still could be a bit temperamental there but that's life, we've just got to learn to live with it. Hopefully with the firmware updates that we have in the future, it will um, get a bit better. Sorry, I'll keep on changing hands. <laughs> so, yeah, and also, the Ninja Walk. <laughs> you, there's that little bobbly, bobbly motion that you, that you get. And I can't do the Ninja Walk for love of the money. I mean, I put this part of the video up, and this is my Ninja Walk. And as you can see from the footage, <laughs> I can't do ninja walk to save my life. It's supposed to make it a bit more smoother, but in my eyes, it's bobbly. It's even more bobbly than or bouncy than ever before. You're supposed to sort of like roll your foot like that. I just can't do it. I keep on practicing. I keep on trying, but no go. <laughs> Probably could do with a fourth axis axis gimbal, like like uh, I think it's Scotty makes stuff. Uh, I think is a guy in Australia that did it or made it and it's like a long arm for the Osmo Pocket and it made it um, so it wasn't as bouncy when you're walking along which will be absolutely very um, very good for the Phoebe Palm whether you can use it for the Phoebe Palm I don't know oh crumbs I'm turning it on no don't want to turn it on while I've got my uh, uh, gibble guard on <laughs> not a good idea why is it going to turn it on there you go it's off now. Yeah, so uh, if, if you get that on uh, for the uh, Phoebe Palm, Scotty Bake stuff, if you want to start doing them for uh, the Phoebe Palm, that would be brilliant. Stop trying to do the silly ninja walk because I just cannot do it at all. So, yeah, for the one in the sense, a small camera, um, decent video, 4K can't grumble i've started filming mine in 1080p because my computer just cannot handle 4k so yeah uh, it makes life um, a lot better and a lot easier when you're filming in 1080p still decent quality the only gripe i, I have really got about uh, the phoebe Park video is when you will use a little joystick to zoom in 
and you lose that little bit of picture quality it starts pixelated a little bit that's uh, same with the pictures as well you start to zoom in and uh, you lose that crisp clear quality it just goes a little bit pixelated so hopefully with future firmware that will sort that out which will be absolutely amazing now for the three uh, modes that you can have you got narrow ultra wide and i think it's super scope i love the super scope because it already gives you the black lines you now the cinematic letterboxes already gives you those which is absolutely awesome ultra wide not too fussed about because when you're panning around you do get that bit of uh, fish eye effect so you know with a fish bowl effect uh, with the picture bending which i'm not too crazy about and also uh the, the uh, narrow i'm starting using that now as well because i like the narrow because there's some things you don't want in your picture and you don't want to try and cut out in post and more accessories uh, will be great for the phoebe palm because uh, like i said in previous videos you can use your um you know what do you call it gopro stuff for it um i haven't got any to hand they're all in my bag <laughs> my bags over yonder so yeah i've got like a like a suction cup that you can stick to your window i mean you can buy some that you can stick to your bike uh, you know if you're zooming along on your uh, on your bicycle stuff like that you can get like hats that uh, where you can attach your femi palm so you don't have to hold it so yeah there's loads and loads and loads of stuff and it's quite cheap as well i mean you don't have to be actual gopro stuff there is a lot of knockoffs so out there on ebay and such such places where you can get cheapo uh, stuff that works just as well so if you're on a tight budget yeah like i said go and have a look on ebay and stuff like that yeah i do like this Fumi palm uh for the money i mean you get it like you're getting it like 150 pounds cheaper than what the osmo pocket is a uh, uh, brand new but i have noticed that uh, ever since the femi palm come out and there's another one v mate uh, i think uh, something like that i think it's called uh, the prices are starting to come down a little bit on ebay so uh, i might consider getting another osmo pocket in the future when and if i can afford it so we'll have to wait and see on that one see what happens and then i can do a proper comparison with the femi palm and the osmo pocket like i said i did have the osmo pocket where i would get a bit peed off because you had to buy this that and the other to actually make it a decent camera it is a decent camera but you know what i mean like the uh you had to get a wi-fi base if your phone wasn't compatible with the old little things that that you're stuck in the middle here <laughs> if you've had a if you've had a um uh osmo pocket before you know what i'm on about and then what else was the yes with the selfie stick uh, or the expansion stick that you had uh, you had to use your phone uh, charger cable to connect to your to your osmo pocket so you could actually use your phone while you're using the old uh, extension rod so yeah extension not expansion i keep wanting to say expansion i don't know why <laughs> but yeah so yeah all in all for the price very good very good little camera nice little travel camera stick it in your bag off you go you're not lugging a great big camera like my canon 550d or whatever you've got um decent ish videos uh time lapses hyper lapses panoramic uh, photos normal photos uh easy to edit in 1080p and if your computer can handle 4k jobs are good mine can't <laughs> <laughs> i need a better computer but yeah i do like it all in all very well done femi palm the only another gripe about it is if you've got to get stuff from femi it's going to take a while because obviously they're based in china which ain't good <laughs> i'm still waiting on me um i've got some filters i've got some uh, charger lead longer charger lead like i said is there anything else i'm waiting on it? oh yes and the case for the phoebe palm uh, which i will be doing reviews on and everything when and if i get them eventually it's supposed to be coming july the 4th uh to the 14th in between there but that was said for the uh, selfie stick that i got for the phoebe palm and i already received that so here's hoping that i'm going to get it sooner rather than later 
<laughs> all right then guys that is my views on the Phoebe palm i hope you have enjoyed this video if you're new around here why don't you consider hitting the big red button and also like comment and sharing that will be absolutely awesome and if you are already here and you enjoyed what i uh, what you saw then please consider hitting like comment and share all right then guys that is another one done and i'll see, and i shall see you in another Phoebe palm video bye for now